27 years ago she adopted this boy. This is how he repaid her many years later. The story I'm going to tell you today might not have happened at all, if one day one person with a big and loving heart didn't go out of his way to help someone else. And as you know, kindness tends to return a hundredfold to the sender. And today you will see this once again. After all, when processing paperwork years ago to adopt a boy, a woman named Ingeborga McIntosh could hardly have imagined the consequences of her noble deed. Long 27 years later, the dedication and boundless love she showed literally saved her life. But first things first. As a young and attractive woman, Ingeborga could never pass by other people's grief, and therefore in her youth, she chose a very unusual and very difficult profession, becoming a guardian for children whose parents abandoned them. Everything began with a simple and boundless love for the little ones. But just a few years later, more than 120 abandoned children have found warmth, attention, and care in the home of their sworn mother. And although Ingeborga treated absolutely every child with boundless care and love, one child simply won her heart. In the orphanage for abandoned children, Ingeborga met a four-year-old boy who was growing up without love or care. He just sat quietly in the corner of the room with a toy car in his hands. What can I say, the woman knew from the first sight that this boy was meant to be hers. However, it wasn't long before the mother was disappointed. The thing is, she could not adopt little Jordan. And, even in spite of good relations with the guardianship authorities, Macintosh was not allowed to take the child with her. The reason for this was the conditions that the birth mother set for further adoption. That is, only African-American or mixed families could adopt Jordan. That is why, for about four years, they looked for a suitable family for the boy all over the country. But since no such family was found, he was forced to live in an orphanage, meeting and seeing off his new potential mommy and daddy every time. And probably that would have been the end of the story. But the woman decided not to give up and fight for this baby. So it took a few years for Jordan to finally become Ingeborg's official son and go to his new home. What happened next? And then the happy life of the baby and his new mother went their way. The boy became an adult and an independent man.